We have no doubt Sang Yi might just end up stealing both the spotlight and our hearts too for this one. If you're way ahead of us though and you're already scarring the internet for more of the actor, then you're in the right place and we will tell you 8 shocking facts about him. So make sure you watch this video till the end. Number 1. He started out in theater. Having graduated from the Korean National University of Arts, it's clear Sang Yi's always had a passion for performing. His acting career began on stage when he debuted in the 2013 musical How to Make a Star. His since appeared in more than 15 theater productions, including the Korean versions of American musicals such as Grease and A Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder. Number 2. He rose to fame for his role in the 2020 drama Once Again. Sang Yi made his TV debut in 2017 as Oh Dao Su in the romantic comedy Manhole. He continued on to land supporting roles until 2020, most notable of all was his character in the family drama Once Again. Spanning 100 episodes, the award-winning drama found Sang Yi as Yoon Jae Suk, a dentist and the younger brother of one of the show's leads, Yoon Kyu Jin. As portrayed by Lee Sang Yop, Sang Yi's romantic plot lined in once again opposite Lee Cho Hee became a fan favorite among viewers, which contributed to the actor's eventual rise to fame. Number 3. He landed his first main role in 2021 with Youth of May. Riding on his newfound fame from once again, Sang Yi finally landed his first lead TV role a year later in the period drama, Youth of May. The actor starred alongside rising hearts Rob Lee Do Hyun and Love Alarm actress Ko Min Shi. The KBS drama was inspired by a historical Korean mass protest dubbed by the Gwangju Uprising. Sang Yi portrayed Lee Soo Jeon in the show, a businessman who returns to Korea after finishing his studies in France. Number 4. He once shot a scene in Youth of May while drunk. When asked about his favorite memory on the set of Youth of May, Sang Yi recalled having to shoot his first scene on the show, which involved drinking alcohol. Despite the fact that I am terrible at drinking, this was also my first day of filming. To calm my nerves, I drank a little to act in the scene. It was memorable because I was actually a little bit drunk, he admitted in an interview with Kokowa. Number 5. He was part of a temporary music group called MSG Wannabe. A musical veteran Sang Yi's singing chops was once again recognized when he was chosen to be part of MSG Wannabe. A super group made up of 8 Korean celebrities, the group was created for the variety show Hang Out With You, famous for having formed other chart-topping temporary groups SSAK3 and Ruffin Sisters. Number 6. And he's also an amazing dancer. Yup, we've got ourselves another multi-talented rising star. Sang Yi first publicly demonstrated his dance skills way back in 2008 when he won a contest with his cover of Rain's Rainism. The actor performed the same routine 12 years later during his appearance on the variety show Knowing Bros. Number 7. He watched a lot of TV shows to prepare for hometown cha-cha-cha. In preparation for his role as a show producer on Hometown Cha Cha Cha, Sang Yi shared that he watched a ton of TV, taking particular note of how each program's producer would act during filming. I watched and observed what these producers would do, and I noticed that they're not very talkative on set and they're usually quietly observing at the back, he added. Aside from that likeness, I tried to also become close with my co-stars so we could bring the chemistry on screen. Number 8. He's a certified plenty dough. Much like the rest of us, Sang Yi also turned into a plenty dough this past year. As someone who does not step out much, the actor revealed that he recently picked up buying plants as a hobby. He's especially fond of greens that can grow in water, as mentioned in his Harper's Bazaar interview. And with this, we have come to the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it and for more such videos, subscribe to our channel.